what Hasbro Beyblade X was just revealed and released? Time to milk these guys for content! Hello everyone and welcome to a tutorial on how to build my Lego Drawn Sword and Hell's Scythe. So let's waste no more time and get right into it. Let's begin with Drawn Sword and of course we'll start with the blade. Here are most of the pieces that you're going to need for the blade, only most of them because for the center construction there are two different ways to build that which I'm going to show in a bit. Here are the pieces you'll need for the first style for the center. And here are the pieces you'll need for the second style for the center. Now that we got the blade finished, let's move on to the ratchet. And here are all the pieces that you're going to need for that. If the connection between the blade and ratchet feels a bit loose, just take off the boat stud and push in the axle, then place it back on, and now it should be nice and tight. Now let's move on to the bit. And here are all the pieces that you're going to need for that. As you can see, it is a very, very simple construction, just like that. And there you go. Now let's move Hell Scythe, and once again, we're going to begin with the blade. Here are all the pieces that you're going to need for the blade. And before you ask, yes, this is being recorded at a different time of the day.
now that the blade is done, let's move on to the ratchet. I'm not going to take this thing apart because the build for these two things are pretty much the exact same. Just instead of having a tile here, these plates here, these tiles here, and this jumper here, just have jumpers on all four sides. Everything else is the exact same as 360. And finally, let's build the taper bit. And here are all the pieces that you're going to need for it. And just like the flat bit, very simple construction. And let's put the full bay together and there we have Hell Scythe. And here's a bonus build on how to build the launcher to launch these bays. And here are all the pieces that you're going to need for the launcher. Oh, and of course the launcher itself. When you're placing it into the launcher, it's nice to have the axle hole in here line up with this plus thing on the launcher itself, just so it can fit nice and flush. And of course, to launch it, you take the bay, put it on like this, and then you pull it, and there you go. Sometimes you might have to shake the launcher, though. So that's my tutorial on how to build my LEGO Drawn Sword and Hell's Scythe. If you enjoyed that video, comment, like, subscribe, stuff like that, and I'll see you in the next video.